Right, so I'm gonna show you the best auto blogging tool ever created. And before I show you how it works, let me show you the output of such tool, right? This is the content that this little tool produces. This article is about, or these articles are in the dog grooming niche. So again, all of this here from images to the interactive table of contents, right? To the internal links, external links, in article images, uh, in article videos as well, right? Because we add in article videos that are relevant, not just to the article itself, right? But to the section in which they're included in, like so, right? All this, even the call to action to booking a call in this um, uh, dog grooming place, right? All this was done through AI. Now, yes, there's a bunch of AI uh, writing tools, none like this one with links, internal and external links, right? Links linking out to other blog posts of yours, other pages on your site, calls to action to your products or services, external links, tables of contents, images, all this, right? But the power of Journalist AI, right, is you can connect it to your blog, right? This is your blog, and your blog can be any one of these right here. If I go to integrations, a new integration, you can connect with WordPress, Shopify, Ghost, Wix, Webflow, Blogger, even Zapier or an external API if you want, right? These will be the most popular ones. So people doing e-commerce, right? They can just connect with their Shopify store and have content produced on the back end on their niche with calls to action to their products or WordPress, more of a service type business. Usually, they usually use WordPress. Now, again, you're here for the auto blog, right? So what this does again, when you connect Journal CI with your blog, Journal CI goes out and generates, right? Plus, it produces, sorry, publishes content on autopilot. And by autopilot, here's what I mean. So if I just close this right here, go to edit, you can choose the quantity of articles you want to produce every single day, right? You can do 300 articles every single month, week, day, 12 or six hours. Usually most people just do five every week, right? But you can do however many articles you want. And it's super simple, right? Just go to tryjournalist.com, uh, set up your integration, right? Because you got to set up your integration first. Click here. Just it takes like 30 seconds. If you don't know how to do it, just click here to watch this tutorial. It's like another one minute, so super, super short. Again, to go to auto blogs, new auto blog. Select your integration right uh, right here. Select the integration you want to you want you want to choose. Select how many blog posts you want. Select the frequency. And then select the preset, right? Which I'll show you in just a second how it works. Then enable this, create new auto blog. In this case, every single week, 80 posts will be posted every single uh, week, right? So also, on top of that, if you go here to indexers, it indexes the content for you on autopilot. So you could just click, click here, sorry, new indexer, and you connect this with Google Search Console. So every single piece of content that's pushed out to your blog will be automatically indexed. It also helps you out with keyword research. So if you go here, I won't create a new one right now, but we go here, add your website, we'll analyze your site, analyze the competition, the niche, the language, and come up with keywords, right? They have low SEO difficulties, so that are easier to rank for, and some decent uh, monthly search volumes, just like the ones you want, right? Like so, and then have Journalist AI generate the blogs for you on autopilot. Now, I won't go dive too deep in how this works, but the best way is just to try it out yourself. Again, I'll leave a link for this in the description. It's tryjournalist.com, and also leave it in the pinned comment down below. Now, uh, if you want to generate, just just no, don't do any auto blogging, just generate articles. You can just do so by here, like simple mode, titles mode, keywords mode. There's these little three modes. Just in the simple mode, let's just go over these ones real quick here. In the simple mode, just give it a URL description, select how many articles you want. Select the language, you can select from over 150 different languages. So it's pretty cool if you're targeting the international markets, you can produce content in Portuguese, Spanish, Turkish, French, whatever. Uh, this usually is, is great for Shopify stores that are targeting international markets for their e-com products. This works great. Or even if, for example, if you have a service business, let's say you're a plumber in New York City and you're targeting these neighborhoods, neighborhoods sorry, where their first language isn't English, you can do so with this. Titles mode, research forward, give it a couple of titles, select the language, click generate. There you go. Keywords mode is more or less the same. Now, the advanced mode is where things get spicy. I won't do it right now, but you have all of these seven steps, which really give you a lot of control over the output, right? And you create a preset, and then once you go to the auto blog, is where you associate a preset with the auto blog that you're producing. Hopefully, that makes sense. But again, base is just like the generation mode. You can even connect your brand here. I won't dive too deep into this, but if you go here and click brands, you essentially connect Journalist AI with your brand, right? And because your brand has multiple assets, your YouTube channel, your LinkedIn, your actual website, some text documents, some audio documents, all these, right? All these are assets, right? And you're connecting Journalist AI with your brand. And so Journalist AI knows as much as you do about your brand, its mannerisms, the images it uses, the way it talks, the way it speaks. So the content isn't generic, right? The content is brand tailored. So pretty cool. Just 
here select your brand and that's it uh, the content down here you can select of course the language you can select the creativity levels this will depend on how you want your brand to be perceived more correct or factual more original you can change the tone of voice you can put neutral funny informal dynamic you can even put a clown voice clown tone you can change the point of view first person for second person whatever um structure right here you can have a force your call to action here so for your actual physical products or services. You can automate the addings or do them yourself. You can add FAQs. You can add key takeaways. Pretty cool. Here's where you add the automatic internal link. So all the articles, once you're connecting Journalist AI with your blog, right, it's producing. These are individual articles every single day, every single week, right, wherever, right? All these will be interlinked between each other in a way that makes sense. Maybe we'll also link out to other pages on your site. Same goes for... The, and to do this, you set it in your, your sitemap, right? External linking as well. So instead of linking out to other pages on your site, we'll link out to authoritative sources in your niche. So if you're producing an article about finance, we'll link out to TechCrunch, we'll link out to Bloomberg, we'll link out to Investopedia, all these authoritative sources in your niche. And to do so, you just click here and we'll scrape the internet for relevant articles in your niche and language. Finally, images, you get access to uh, stock photos, Google Ads free photos. You can even use your own custom images or these two AI models, Stable Diffusion or DALI 3. And of course, you can enable featured images on your articles and in-article images. And finally, videos down here. You just click this and we'll read through the article, right? Read through all the article. We'll then go on YouTube and figure out where's what's the best video to include inside of the article, just like I showed you before, right? Then go here, create new preset, go to autoblog again, new autoblog, and associate here the preset that you just created, right? Pretty straightforward, select the frequency, and then you're ready to go. Now, again, these are how the articles look like. Uh, I'm going to show you here another uh, niche example. For example, this is for a carding school, right? How to drive a card as a beginner or tips for dying card as a beginner. All this is AI generated. Even the images, right? These look realistic, but these are all AI generated, right? The videos, this again, all AI generated. And down here, there's, of course, a call to action too. Uh, this business right here so you can of course book a call in, or book a time at their carding um, website right so all this again pretty cool and you can if you don't want to set up an auto blog just click here and post your wordpress site next post so you can post it manually to a wordpress site shopify or whatever or just click here publish all two integration and publish all two together now if you want to move it, move it a step further just set up an auto blog right and as the content is generated it's published to your blog again Journalist AI is pretty cool because once it's connected with your blog it does the keyword research right like i said before plus does the content generation, right? Plus the content publishing, right? Plus the content indexing and does all this for you, right? So you have more time to focus on your business. So that's it. That's a part of this tool. Again, I'll leave a link for this in the description and also in the pinned comment down below. Try it out. Let me know what you think. And yeah, I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.